Hey guys, it's Sam here from Millennium Productions, and I'm, today I'm going to be showing you how I do my um, gun shots on Windows Live Movie Maker. I know some of my friends have been asking me how I do it, so yeah. First, you want to open Windows Live Movie Maker and insert your um, video into Windows Live Mo Movie Maker. Then, press play or go through frame by frame and find the shot w where you're shooting it, where you want to add in the muzzle flare for me it's here so then we go edit split and then go home snapshot then name it whatever you want GH. Do it save. You can delete that or you can keep it, whatever you want. Then you go minimize. Find what program you're going to um, edit it on. For me, it's paint because most of. I'm using Windows Live Movie Maker because all every time, other time I try to get different ones, it never works. Okay, so you open that up. File. Oh, I'm using paint.net. It's free and you can free to download it. Yeah, it's like, um, a lot like, what's it face? Um, okay, you can't find it. Put that in there. Then you want to do layers, import from file. You want to go to Google Images and find a um, a gun shot, like a muzzle flare, and then save it as. And then it's best if it's on a black background. You see why in a moment. So then you go like that. Grab the magic tool. And just click on the black, and it will outline that. Just press delete, and that will come up. Then you get the box tool. Then you just put the box over that. Then click the arrow next to it, and then you can. If it's too big. You can grab the corners and resize it, and then just move it into place. To, yeah, into the right place. You can shrink it down. You can make it really long. Gun shots should be about the size of the gun shooting it. As said, Freddie Wong. And then just add it in, and then do file, save, GHA, and then make sure you save as type. JPEG and then you do save and then it will come up with this just so you can add in if you want it to be really crappy or you want it to be good like that click OK it will ask you to flatten which is putting both of them into one just click flatten and then it's okay one second I need this I'm gonna sneeze no nope, I'm good and then you minimize that. You can close it off if you want, but it's best not to just in case you did something wrong. Then you go add videos and photos. Go down and find what you called it. Then H A there. And then you drag it to where it is, drop it in, and then you edit and then change it because to if it's a gun shot usually 0 0.5 is the best because it doesn't take too long and you can still see it so then afterwards and yeah okay um 
some of you ask, I don't know how to add in sound effects. I've tried going home, uh, add music, and then I've got um, different ones here that I downloaded, but I don't know how to add them in, like pistols, just grab one that, and then we do options, 0 0.0. Five or however long the frame is. Oh, oops, this should be there. And I don't know, it just doesn't work. Mm. Um, start time. I don't know. Sometimes a way to do it. Please message me or send me a video response. And that and so yeah. Thanks for watching, and I might do.